Good morning. Uh, this is June 25th. Uh, I just broke into Maine uh, last evening. Uh, so I'm in Maine. I'm at Carlos uh, Shelter. It's more like a cabin without a door. Uh, as you can see in the background, it's got a loft. They say 12 people here. I'm kind of bummed out because Carlos didn't bake me no cake. Uh, I don't understand it. Uh, <laughs> anyways, uh, I had two extremely tough down climbs. Uh, in fact, the last one coming in here, uh, huge boulders. Uh, I got my bear rope out and a beaner and left my pack down over the rock face and free climbed it down uh, because it was just a whole lot easier because uh, that big pack of mine I mean even though the, the, the weights you know uh, right on the borderline on what I want to carry uh, it tends to sway back and forth a little bit throw you off balance and it was for safety reason i uh slid the pack down uh pack's getting pretty beat up uh, probably retire it cut the buckles off and uh save the good parts and and uh throw the pack away because it's it's starting to get ripped up pretty good uh from Mount Mariah down. There's a lot of uh, down trees. The brush hasn't been cut back. And from uh, Route 2 to over here, uh, the brush needs cut back. And needs a little bit more paint uh there was some guessing coming across the top and uh stuff i know there was some rock carns which helped but uh there was still places that i actually had to get gut hooks out and follow a little uh ball to find a trail uh paint mark would have been quite helpful slowed me up a bit uh, i didn't get here till dark uh, I think it was 6.5 miles, and it was it was all I could do. In fact, I had to stop and eat eat a eat a snack uh, part way here because I was out of gas. I uh, just totally burned out. Uh, there's rain coming in; and it's starting to cloud up. Uh, Knees are stiff. I pulled my knee again, so I I was being gingerly coming coming across and down. Uh, Mount Muslik, uh, I think that's how you pronounce it, coming up, and it's supposed to be stonier. Heck, I don't know if it's going to have the boulders like like I, I went through yesterday. I'm hoping no boulders. Rocks, eh? I'll take my time, but boulders. They really slow you up, especially, you know, trying to to, to find the handholds and, and stuff to climb down. Climbing down is easier on my knees, so that's what I've been doing. Uh, yesterday it was like 2.1, 2.5 uh, boulder scramble. Uh, very tough. Uh, from the Wildcats to here has been... Really, really, really tough. Uh, I can't see anybody doing it in barefoot. The, the, the granite will just tear your feet up. Uh, so, I'm going to go to the privy, and I'm going to throw the pack on, and I'm going to start out. It's, I don't know what time it is. Somewhere getting close to 7 o'clock. I was up early, got my breakfast, and it was just 
I'm stiff and, and it's taken me a long time to pack up, but no big deal. Uh, if I make it to the next shelter, I make it to the next shelter. Uh, hopefully I can find a uh, stealth site, but if it's like it was yesterday, there will be no stealth sites. So I may have to come in. I'm hoping my batteries hold out for my headlamp. Uh, lucky, all I had to do is cook and, and uh, get ready for bed with a headlamp last night and burn it real, real, real long. But I'm down to one spare battery and because uh, I had some long days uh, in the Wildcats and uh, going into Trident. Then I got screwed up coming out of Trident and got lost and went down a moose trail and had to get the map out and the compass out and I had to bushwhack and uh, that's there's some rough territory up here. Um, just not kidding. So be careful. Uh, use your map and compass, or hopefully you have uh, an iPhone with a little bit better uh, graphics than uh, this LG does. Uh, we've got hooks, but uh, the mileage. The mileage ain't matching up uh, terrible. They use GPS, uh, and uh, they should be using uh, rods or chains for the mileage because it's too much up and down and around, and GPS shoots straight lines, and uh, it'll say it's 3.5, and it's, you know, it's 5 miles. And... Uh, It'd be even tough to use uh, pay speeds here. Uh, I know as, as farther north as I get, more people are looking for the videos. I'm sorry I'm not posting. Uh, it's either been raining. Uh, last night I was going to do a video at the uh, state line, and it was so windy. Uh, I'm hoping that... Uh, the shoulder here is blocking the wind, so you can hear me real good. Uh, we'll catch you later. I'll update as soon as I can. Uh, get it uploaded. It's tough because there's not real good cell service here. Catch you later.